De La Wright, my envies. Welcome. A chattering bed. They say bills no next. As we are hearing what is going on right now, they say um, Paropo has slammed the only of Ife that your quest to get an exact replica of Queen Naomi's replacement is a journey in futility as Queen Naomi is irreplaceable. Now, why is Paropo saying this? They say Paropo is saying this because of the fact that Oni of Ife is um, um, adamant about stopping this issue of getting married. Even though wives have not been introduced um, um, officially, but they say more wives are coming into the palace. Like uh, we all heard that Olori Naomi gave um, um, Oni of Ife, you know, um, f um, three um, um, conditions to come back. One, um, first of all, they said she said that um, Oni should announce her around, um, around the wall again. That is, announce her uh, to everybody. Number two, Oni should, you know, stay away from these women and stop marrying, not marry again. Number three, Ebony should go, that she cannot share the same man with Ebony, not after the disappointment that Ebony gave to her and betrayer. Now, um, when Oni, Oni of Ife is rumored to be really, really adamant about getting Olori Naomi back. He wants Naomi back at all costs. But right now, with what the Oni of Ife is rumored to be doing, is a clear case of a man or a person who eats his cake and wants to have the cake back. Because Nami is not, Nami, I said this before, Nami said she is not coming back. Now, the kind of conditions that Olori Naomi gave to the Oni of Ife should tell everybody that she is not ready to come back. Because telling Oni of Ife to go and do away with Ebony at a time like this is suicidal. Should Oni of Ife try anything like that with Ebony, I tell you, that will be the beginning of his dethronement because Ebony is an Ife uh, blood and she is royalty. I don't, I don't want to know what people think she... Uh, uh, about Ebony, I do know that um, uh, people have their resentment towards Ebony because of some of the things that she did to Lori Nami, which was really, really bad. But the fact remains that Ebony is royalty from Ilefe from a different ruling house. Right now, Ebony gave birth to a male child, and we are all aware that Oni of Ife cannot throw Ebony out of um, the family anymore. As it is now, Ebony um, uh, stay in the palace is completely sealed, okay? And so, um, Olori Naomi told Kabiesi to um, uh, put Ebony out. Now, with the conditions that Olori Naomi, a beautiful Olori Naomi, placed before Kabiesi, that alone should tell you, that alone is an indication that Olori Naomi doesn't want to come back to that palace because... Oni of Ife is not going to meet those conditions. Like, it's not even possible. It's not something that is even doable in the first place. He will not. And so, now, one of the conditions, as you know, is to stop marrying. Um, if they are eight down, let the eight be, and KBSC should stop marrying and not go close to them again. So, Paropo has asked when... Um, KBSC is rumored to have spoken to Paropo about the conditions. Um, Paropo asked KBSC, what do you want to do? And KBSC said he's not going to stop um, marrying because he has made certain promises to certain families that he would go ahead and marry, but he would try and speak to Olori Nami. And they said that was when um, Paropo told him that your quest to get a, a direct replica of Olori Nami is something that you can never even get because Nami is irreplaceable. <laughs> Now, for a father of a king to be saying that that girl is irreplaceable, it goes to tell you a lot. It goes to tell you that this Nami is a very good person. Nami has got a very great quality. See, let me tell you something. You know that when you're a Doshi, sorry I brought this in, 
When uh, May Edoche and Yole Edoche issue broke out, uh, the internet went agog. People were saying that um, uh, they are hearing from only one side. Let them hear from your side. Yole is not coming forth to explain. Wanting, wanting. Do you know what sealed the matter for everybody, all the Nigerians? It was the fact that Pet Edoche came and gave a running commentary of uh, May Edoche. Stated it clearly that May is an uh, amazing, like an amazing daughter-in-law to him. Said May had been, you know, like 80% instrumental to building that family and building everything they have up until today. That he openly expressed his love for May Edoche. And now for, for something like that to have come from your father, that was what finished everything. Then now, you know, uh, concluded everybody knew then that look, the problem is from the man and not from the woman. So they said that one of the major reasons why KBC is marrying and marrying and marrying, he is trying to, you know, um, fill up that space that Nami has created in his life. And he is also thinking that um, there might just be a possibility that he gets somebody that will uh, really replace Olori Nami. Now, you see, they said that among the four wives that he made arrangement to marry. Two of them two of them were virgins and absolutely young. But we heard, as it is rumored, that one backed out shortly after the birthday event that she does not have the capacity to put up with what she saw right there in the palace. Nobody knows what she saw. Nobody knows um, what... And, and, and made her to, um, to step back, okay? Now, remaining one virgin girl, this virgin girl, the one we, are, we had now that uh, 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 the monarch wanted to marry, that virgin girl, they said that that girl can drink. That's another one we are hearing. You know. And they said that that virgin girl is from the north, okay? And so... Um, they said it was even because of this that um, uh, Paropo told Oni of Ife that his quest to get a replica of Olori Nami in terms of character, in terms of looks and everything is going to be exercised in futility because that will never happen. That Nami is an irreplaceable woman that KBSC should, you know, um, 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 be very careful with how he goes with all these women he's marrying on daily basis. That is what we are hearing. Do not forget, these are all alleged rumored um, um, information that um, uh, with all these women that he's marrying every day, hoping that one day he's going to see a Naomi amongst them, that uh, Paropo has so KBAC that uh, uh, he will never see a Naomi amongst these women. That the best thing for him to do is to adjust, if he truly wants to adjust, but never ever think that he can eat his cake and still have it. Going to bring him an update. I appreciate you so much, and I love you. Thank you. Do not forget, these are all alleged rumor and speculated information making the rounds on social media.